In today's video, we're gonna compare the myosinite electrolytes to a very popular electrolyte product and look at just the ingredients. What are differences in the quantities and types of ingredients? Again, the myosinite electrolytes versus a very popular electrolyte product and starting off with the sodium. Now, remember, sodium is very affordable. You have salt, right? You have Morton's table salt on the low end of quality up to real ancient sea salt. So on the sodium side with the myosinite electrolyte sticks, it's not super salt heavy because you can salt your food. That's the whole point is there's other ingredients in there that are very specific to supporting healthy hydration. But on the sodium level, you have 310 milligrams of sodium. But the source of the sodium in the myosinite electrolyte sticks is ancient real salt. Now what you have in a very popular electrolyte product is a thousand milligrams of sodium. Okay, but the source of that is who knows? They're not enumerating or listing the source. If it was an ancient sea salt, I'm sure they would list that on the label, but it's just probably a sodium chloride, maybe a, a Morton's table salt, okay? Let's go on down the list. We know potassium is hard to get from the diet, so that makes sense to put money at supporting potassium, unless you're eating a bunch of avocados and bananas. Most people are not getting enough potassium. So per serving in the myosinite electrolyte six, you're getting 450 milligrams. In the popular electrolyte product that many people take, by the way, which is more expensive than this one, you're getting only 200 milligrams. You're getting twice the potassium. What about magnesium, you might say? I love magnesium. Everyone loves magnesium. Well, in, in this formula, you're getting 170 milligrams. In this, you're getting 60 milligrams, okay? So you're getting one third less of the magnesium in this product, which costs more, but it doesn't end there. Here's what's unique. If you look at the calcium chloride, and you might say, well, I don't care about calcium chloride. Why would I care about that? Well, studies have shown that the best electrolyte solution includes sodium, potassium, magnesium, and calcium chloride, okay? In addition to, to creatine taurine, you're getting 150 milligrams because chloride is an electrolyte, okay? You're getting zero milligrams in a very, in all the popular electrolyte products, okay? Now you might say, well, gosh, what about taurine and creatine? Well, in the myosinite electrolyte sticks, you're getting 500 milligrams. Taurine is an amino acid. In the future, there's a lot of health benefits linked with taurine. Many people are not getting enough taurine in the diet, and there's some good research to show that taurine helps support healthy hydration uh, as well. Now, what about creatine? You're not getting, you're getting zero creatine, zero taurine here. Uh, what you're getting here is one gram, one gram of creatine, okay? You're getting zero uh, grams here. Now you might say, look, Mike, I'm just trying to find an electrolyte. I don't care about creatine and taurine. Well, you should care because research actually shows in athletes that when you pair creatine with electrolytes, you get better sports performance, which is presumably why you're trying to take the electrolytes. It's, it's one thing to support hydration, but wouldn't you like to support hydration and get a better workout? So that's why this formula is so unique. And I think a lot of people haven't done head-to-head -head comparisons in looking at what's in this product compared to many of the other products out there, which again, needless to say, are actually more expensive. So if you like to pay more and get less, that's all, that's cool, that's fine. If you wanna get a, a, an electrolyte that doesn't have as much and buy creatine on top of that, that's cool. If you wanna spend 60 bucks a month, that's fine. But what you could do is spend around $37, $39 a month and you get your creatine covered, especially intra-workout or pre-workout creatine or even post-workout because it's important to recognize that moving your muscles increases the absorption of creatine by about 20%. So for those people that are like, well, I need to take 10 grams a day or five grams. Well, if you take it while you're working out, you don't need to do these higher levels because it's absorbed and utilized better by the working muscle. So that's important. But also research shows that these electrolytes here help the creatine work better. Now, again, these are there's just two studies showing this in athletes, but I think there's gonna be emerging research because the creatine transport protein depends on these electrolytes. And so it just makes sense to pair these things together. And so I wanted to, to just make this to help you understand, although at Myoscience we can't talk about treating, diagnosing, curing, or preventing disease, we're talking about optimizing and supporting healthy hydration and athletic performance. Hydration and creatine are inextricably linked. You can't disentangle these two things. And when we're talking about hydration, many people want to support hydration because you're athletic, you want to exercise, you wanna get more mileage from your workouts and better recovery. And so pairing these synergistically physiologically related processes just makes a whole lot of sense. So hopefully you now understand that you're getting not only higher quantities, but the forms 
are different in the mineral composition, the electrolyte composition. For example, the magnesium is diamagmalate. Um, this is from Albion Labs. Albion is the world's leader in raw materials for minerals. They're based out of Salt Lake City, Utah. And then you're also getting a real salt. It's not USP sodium. This isn't Morton's table salt. This is an ancient sea salt that also has trace elements and trace minerals in there as well. So now you know the difference here between the electrolyte sticks and various other popular electrolytes that are out there. And there's some good brands. They're, they're really helping to increase the awareness of electrolytes. So I wanna thank them for doing that. But again, we just put this product together to have a more synergistic health benefit, especially for people who go in the sauna, who do intermittent fasting, or who are serious about improving the efficiency of their workouts. You might wanna consider this, uh, the electrolyte sticks by Myoscience.